Do 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 do. Oh, there you are. Oh, hi, I didn't see you guys there. Uh, so on this episode, Cooking with Trevor, we're going to be making s'mores. Because who hates mosquitoes but doesn't want to go outside and be over the campfire? You know? I'd rather be in my house. So, here I got my truck that I keep it in my fridge so it doesn't melt as easy. So, we're going to begin. See ya. the fridge with my Hershey's chocolate and we're making s'mores today. You need your three key ingredients which are your chocolate of course, your graham crackers and of course the marshmallow which we'll be roasting on our nice big stove. So first things first, you're going to want to fire up your stove. So fire up and just keep it on a nice lower kind of medium heat and then you'll take whatever kind of fork you have anything works if you got one of those fancy marshmallow turners those work great but this just gets the job done so you just stick your marshmallow on and you're just gonna hold it over the flame over the center and just turn just keep turning and it'll start to get a nice golden brown if it lights on fire every now and then just blow it out it won't be a big deal a little burnt flavor is good. Now this is something great you can do if you have little kids or your family. You can make these with your kids after dinner as a great dessert. And you won't have to go outside and worry about starting a whole campfire and worry about all the mosquitoes and all that. Something quick and easy you can have fun with. So just keep turning and make sure you don't burn the mellow. I call them mellows for short because they're kind of cool sounding. Maybe you want to turn the heat up just a little bit more. But be careful, you don't want to go too hot, you'll easily burn it. You can see it's starting to puff up here and starting to smoke. It's getting those golden brown right there. It's getting pretty good. And yeah, so just keep turning, keep turning. It's looking pretty good. You want to go a little bit closer. Careful not to burn it. This one's turning out great. Oh, it's almost there. Now, that's about kind of where I like it. But you want to keep making more browner than you can. And I'm just going to go over here. Break my graham cracker in half. Slide it right onto the graham cracker. Just put my fork down on the plate. Now I can take that great Hershey's chocolate and put it on top. Oh, don't forget to turn your fire off because you don't want to burn yourself in the process. And then you're just going to edge your top and that's what you, how you make a graham cracker. But of course, you've got to take the bite. You can't just not try it. So, I'm just going to take a bite. They're delicious. They're soft going. Okay, what does this view look like? Check me out. Cook, cook, cook. I have no pork to do. This one's like up to cut the meat, cut it right up. 